this is the floating plate form deep water culture where there is the water here air is thrown into this this is air stone so you just support every water always has got air in it compressed air or dissolved air which has got oxygen so once the plants are growing they draw roots draw oxygen and so it get depleted so you will have to replenish it by uh, circulating air through it then you have this is the nutrient film technique where you can have a slope or you can have a level also we are not using any slope we are using it level still it works very well then you have this substrate based system where you grow things in the substrate the water goes into it it comes back also overflow in the dutch bucket kind of system or it may not come back all depends on what kind of system you do we are we prefer non circulatory for grow bags and dutch buckets because circulatory system will create problems requirements are already defined okay. now we tomato we give 1 liter water every day so system is designed to dispense 1 liter har plant ko 1 liter deta hai wo bilkul and measure karke because the wine crops have a life more than 45 days leafy mostly have the life less than 45 days and they are harvested in totality but some are not harvested in totality like basil is not harvested but where the seeds are cheaper basil is also harvested as a single crop and next time so on so on. arugula is another thing which is harvested many time multiple times your coriander is also harvested multiple times but you can always uh, do it uh, in one go also so this is our photographs this is uh, we designed a turf for the deep water culture this is from feedcoat farm this is nothing but a 6 inch wide uh, board this uh, ply board and then there is a 4 mm layer below and then 6 inch then it is covered with a poly sheet this 200 micron you put a poly sheet you make the turf like this at the corner you can add aluminum angles so that doesn't give away then put a sheet into it and in this sheet fill it with water now then sheet will automatically get spreaded properly then then turn it and then put a small gola jise kehte hain lakdi ka and small it can be fabricated by your neighbor it can be fabricated by a carpenter so you can have somebody want to have it on the rooftop somebody want to have it for the house 50 plants 60 plants you can have styrofoam sheets are available 4 is to 8 feet so you can have holes in styrofoam with they can be very easily made and you can use 3 inch net cup and have this 8 by 4 can have 64 cups so you can have if somebody want a small system for the his domestic use at home this is a very good system here you can use it this is uh, your nft these are openable channels we will show you that we have openable channels here our nft got very badly damaged we the biggest damage was the nft all the platforms were damaged all the nft were twisted turned all the net cups washed away so these are openable channels very simple and uh, they are single layer channel also available double layer channel also we are using double layer channel so that the water is kept cooler net pot is 3 inch never ever use 2 inch net pot lot of consultant have cheated hydroponic farmer by asking them to use 2 inch and now they have openly saying that 2 inch was a absolute failure and lot of farmer suffered because of the 2 inch net pot because 2 inch net pot is so small that it won't let the roots grow properly so this is a a frame system where you have a frame like this and then you stack these nft channels depending on the distance between the two cups depend on the crop for lettuce it is 8 inch for something you can have 6 inches if you are harvesting whole diameter is almost the whole diameter 3 inch 3 inch, Three inch. So the net pot has net pot will have to go into it so this is the flat bed system this is the system which we are using here because this system people lot of consultant will suggest to it's a very costly system this is called a frame and the difference between this and this of the plant is not very high but this is very difficult to balance very difficult to manage more expensive to install and more power consumption because you have to lift water here these flat beds are the easy to control easy to manage this is what we are using here and this is multi layer flat bed which you can use if you are using artificial lighting systems because the plants below will not receive the proper light yes, yes. so you will have to put a lighting system in between here also the lower plants sometimes don't get proper light and the difference is hardly 10% or maybe less than that the difference between the number of plants in this system and this system so lot of consultants are suggesting people to have a frames 